Hello guys, it's Lucas, the Transformers Skyfire slash Prowl fan here, and today I'm back with another retrospective. In today's retrospective, it's finally time to get down into this Autobot. It's finally to get, time for me to get down into that jet Autobot who believes in science is the key to winning the war, the science... The scientist jet Autobot, Skyfire. Now, the original Skyfire started out in the original Transformers G1 series. He was introduced in Season 1, Episode 7, Fire in the Sky. And Skyfire is very characterized as being... A scientist and also that stuff. He was once a friend of Starscream who had crash landed on Earth while on a scientific um explore and discovery millions of years ago and had been frozen frozen in Arctic ice. Discovered and revived by the Decepticons in the present day, Skyfire uh, hesitated kind of with his old friend Starscream trying to continue his past friendship with him. But after seeing the truth of the Decepticons and their treachery, when his eyes were open to their evil, he sided with the Autobots against them. And then he buried the green crystal that was going to take and destroy the earth. And it concluded him being buried in ice once more. But the Autobots soon had him thawed out to join them on several more adventures. And also, yeah. And basically, you guys, Skyfire was just used as an, basically an Autobot transporter, meaning he would take them to other places by flying them, such as he did in the episode of Fire on the Mountain, took them to South America in Peru. I think that's in South America. I'm not really sure, you guys. And Skyfire was a main part of the cast. He remained a part of its cast throughout the first season. But unfortunately, you guys, Skyfire was discontinued in 1985 in the season two line. He was dropped from the show and discontinued a few episodes into the second season. And also, yeah, once he was discontinued, you guys, that was it. They don't even resemble him. They did not resemble or show him in any other version. Until the War for Cybertron trilogy, where it was at that point where they recreated the original G1 character. This, ver this version of Skyfire... From Transformers War for Cybertron Trilogy. Had the same looking jet mode as he did in the original G1 series. And also, yeah. Well, anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on that bell for notifications. Now, I'll see you guys in the next video. And peace, y'all. Peace.